what up guys it's like the fourth video already like I'm, I'm knocking out the bangers right now i'm still with my boy trill young wavy and this is now Corey's car life and i'm checking out this like auto like show, show auto, auto show. show i'm still getting my, my language together because i'm still trying to understand and learn how to do the lingo but yeah we're about to go check out this little auto world that's going on here in houston and check out some cool cars all right guys so i'm sitting inside of like the mustang i think mock is how you pronounce it it is so lit man look it has a whole touch screen it's really giving me tesla vibes bro everything about this car reminds me of a tesla and uh i don't know i can't i can't help it but i, I definitely gotta give it a shot one day i gotta give me an electric car because I'm, I'm telling y'all it just clearly is the future it's the wave and i used to have a mustang so it's kind of like a little nostalgia moment for me right now but this is dope Oh yeah okay guys so once i actually got inside of the auto show it was pretty dope man it was like cars everywhere i mean pretty much imagine this a huge warehouse the size of like two walmart stuck together which is nothing but cars and boats and all kinds of cool stuff uh the first section that me and trill kind of like hung out in was like the chevy area and it was really cool because i got to check out the corvette c8s and just check out like how they're like check out the difference between the one that's like a basic package and then the one that's like a top end more performance type of car i'm not gonna lie when it comes to me and cars i really like the way they look i'm not really big on performance i think it's cool to have a car that can perform but i'm not a street racer i don't really want to go to a drag strip and like try to see how fast it can go i purely just like the way cars look and i like the feeling you get when you can kind of turn heads i'm more all about like the design it just really just the way it looks and honestly there were a lot of good looking cars here at this auto show even when we were in the ford section i got to see how ford is like pushing the envelope and trying to really go electric as well they had a fully electric mustang there as well that was really dope to see you know me when i was younger i actually used to have a ford mustang it was a 2005 ford mustang it was convertible it was race red i love that car it was the first car i started actually kind of modding and putting rims and all kind of different stuff on it before it broke down on me and it was kind of like a little baby to me i should have kept it going but i kind of gave up on that car now that i have my 2021 honda civic i plan on kind of doing some similar things to it like maybe changing a little bit of the trim level and stuff like that upgrading it but yeah it was really cool to see all these electric cars man like when i was in that car it really felt like a tesla and to be honest with you being at this car show it was almost like overwhelming i mean there were so many cars so many different makes and models to choose from and just and to just walk around it was like being a kid in a candy store you didn't really know exactly where to go i think probably the coolest part of the auto show was being able to ride in the jeeps because jeep had brought out some really cool souped up jeeps that can go off-roading and they set up pretty much like a course that had a lot of different hills and turns and all kinds of stuff that you can get in the car or a truck and ride through these little like indoor tracks that they created for you to be able to see how the suspension works and all the four wheel drives and all kind of stuff like that it was really it was really crazy it was actually kind of scary going up and down some of those hills and bumps and stuff like that but it was cool man this is lit y'all that was lit and we haven't even done the coolest part yet that's the crazy thing. Y'all see that guy? Here, driver girl oh <laughs> man has no fear at all <laughs> she done did this a million times oh, this, this is oh, crazy. way more than that way more than that i've been doing this like six years with jeep so oh, oh, man. Man. <laughs> why does this feel like a roller oh we about to drop american muscle i don't do this <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, i don't do this if you guys have never been to the auto show in Houston or just in any auto show in general and you like cars in any type of way, definitely go. It, it actually can kind of be like a little date too on the cool to walk around, check out some vehicles. They actually have food there. You know, it was it was just really cool. And then of course, I definitely saw my ultimate favorite vehicle right now, which is the Lamborghini. Pretty much any Lamborghini. I like Aventadors. I like Hurricanes too, but Lamborghini in general is usually my favorite car brand. I'm working my way up to get there one day and just to be able to see it, it was like it was like an all gold Lamborghini. I think the company that brought out that, they were really just trying to show off that they wrap vehicles. They were actually in the process of wrapping a Range Rover all pink right there in the car show. But anyway, it was really cool just to be there. Actually, uh, I believe Rolls Royce was there. Uh, there was a lot of like supercars there. There was a Bugatti there, but they had it like really sectioned off so you couldn't just like walk in and go see the cars and touch any of those cars. They had like little bodyguards there to make it seem like it's way more of a big deal than really what it is. You know how Lamborghini has to keep their exclusivity 
exclusive. But yeah, all together, man, I had a great time. It was just cool just to be in an environment or in a world where there's nothing but cars around you. There was even like a little section where they had like green screen where we could make like a little like comic script. I think Chevy had did that. It was like you could you could be in this little booth and you take a few different pictures and at the end it, it prints off in a comic book style to where it changes the background and you're like in a comic book and there's like action going on. And of course it has something to do with like a car and rescuing somebody. It was just cool, man. It was just cool just to see how creative these companies were getting to be able to, to be able to market their companies and keep them relevant. And once again, it was really dope just to see how the car industry is pushing forward more and more into this whole electric lane. I, I love to see it. I'm here for it. I feel like this can this can help a lot with just like the fossil fuels and like the pollution in the air in general. So I look forward to getting an electric car one day and I'm sure you guys will all own one as well one day in the near future. I also did get an opportunity to see my car or the, the newer model of my car, the Honda Civic there as well in the same color as my car that I actually have. So that was pretty cool. I had a quick little glimpse to like play with that and just check out the newer model, the 2023 Honda Civic. It looks pretty nice. I'm still happy with my car though as well, the 2021, but it looks pretty nice. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed checking out the car show as much as me and Trill Young Wavy did. Once again, if you guys wanna be able to follow Trill and see some of the footage that he was taking, make sure you follow his YouTube channel, link in below. And also, if you wanna see all the photos that I was taking, I took tons and tons of photos. Make sure you go to my vlog at canoncorey.com. You guys can check out all the photos I've been taking from multiple different videos and trips and stuff like that. And you guys can definitely see all the cool photos and images that I got at the car show. But with that said, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying this new channel. Corey's car life is definitely here in full effect. I'm gonna continue to drop some more content. I appreciate the algorithm helping me get out there for the couple of views that I'm already getting with no subscribers is, I think it's excellent. I'm actually happy for it. So yeah, there it is, man. Make sure you guys go out there and be great. Do everything with a spirit of excellence. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.